excited to have the arms now for the threes and the Ys because the S's and X's we've been doing the camera correction with the intuitive parts forever. They are just the best. Uh, we use them in all of our cars. Uh, we've compared them to every other arms and nothing else compares to it. Uh, they're fantastic and we're glad that we can finally bring the camera correction to the people owning threes and Ys so that they can take care of the inner tire wear on their cars also. We're going to be installing a set of these camber and tow arms for the Model 3 and Model Y. We're going to walk you through the process. It's pretty quick and easy. Uh, these are direct replacements for the factory arms. A couple things to note is uh, the tools that we'll need are the 21 millimeter fasteners, 18 millimeter fasteners, and then we got some different wrenches here, and the most importantly, the torque wrench. Now, with the torque wrench, we have a couple values that we're going to need to set for the tow arm. There's going to be two values. We have 85 newton meters on the inside, 76 newton meters on the outside. The camber arm is 134 newton meters on both sides. Another important key is after you get your arm set, make sure that your fastener is pointing down. We want to make sure we have as much room as we can for the arm to articulate. Alright, before we begin our install, make sure you have your car secured properly. Here I have the convenience of a lift, so we just got it on our lift. Um, when you're doing this at home, jack your car up, get it on jack stands, everything's nice and secure. Then you're going to have your wheel removed. Once you have your wheel removed, come on in here and I'll show you the four arms that we, or the two arms that we got to remove on this side. This is what's going to be removed to become your camber arm. The, this is the upper aft uh, control arm. And then we have this uh, lower arm here for the tow arm. That's the factory tow arm. You can see the factory eccentric bolt there. That's what they do for the alignments. Uh, they have a small amount of adjustment as that bolt moves in and out. When you put your intuitive arms on, you're going to have a much larger range of adjustment available to you. So basically, two points right here to remove off of this arm, two points to remove off of this arm. We need to get started right here. And then now we're going to switch to our 21s that come over here. And then our final one here. All right, now we have all the bolts loosened, we're going to take the arms out of here and we're swapping new ones in. Sometimes they're a little tight and you just gotta help them wiggle out. Okay, now we're going to go ahead and just snug everything up here. Okay, now we're going to tighten the camber arm. After we get this snug here, we're going to put the jack underneath the car so that we can preload the suspension and then we're going to torque everything down.
we're going to jack this up right to the point where it's about to start lifting on the car. That is our ride height. Okay, we're going to put the camber arm to 134 newton meters here. Five for the inner, and then we'll do 76 for the outer. Right now they're all torqued, we're going to go ahead and let this back down. And then now go ahead and put the wheel back on, 126 Newton meters for the wheel take the car to your alignment shop and uh, decide the specs that you want based on what Intuitive has on the website. Hey, thanks for joining us today. I uh, hope you have a pretty easy time installing them in your own driveway. If you decide that you don't want to tackle this, give us a call, uh, EV Fix Me, we're in Costa Mesa. We can get these installed for you. I just wanted to give a big thank you to EV Fix Me and Intuitive for helping my husband out. Um, I initially had come to Dawn with my Model X Plaid um, to get some camber arms and my lowering links and after seeing my tires um, after 10,000 miles I, I knew that we needed to have this for our three. I'm super excited to save some money on our tires and get that perfect fitment so thank you guys very much for taking us over today. Thank you.